It's the kind of beat to go Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joey and this is World Domination Let's Play number three for the beginners. It's also a walkthrough, but you know, whatever works for you guys. But let's go ahead. This is our third one and we're going to be looking at Vancouver today and also some other stuff. We got guilds. We got the flare perk now. As you can see, it did finish researching. We have the flare available to us. Let me go ahead and collect some resources, get me some more stuff, more crates and cans. And as you can see, let me go ahead and show you my team really quick. So as you can see, I've been doing a little bit of upgrading just to kind of upgrade my personal favorites, which is the firefighter, the merc, and the sniper. Now, I've also got the rest of my team up to level two just to have a little bit extra firepower. But let me go through this. The fire chief, I mainly upgrade that just because it's the main tank melee unit that's going to be up front taking a whole lot of the damage. I think it's really important to have that one upgraded at first until you get the, the fire chief. That's when you upgrade that one. But I think it's really important to have that upgraded near the most at first. Now, the next one is the Mercenary Level 3. That's my personal favorite unit by far, that and the scatter shot. So that's going to be one of my main upgrades, of course, too. And then the Sniper to take out those mutated zombies. I think it's really important to have one of those upgraded, too. So let's go ahead and get into Vancouver here. And let's get some attacking going. Now, let's get attack in. So we have four places to go. And once we hit this, we're going to get a rare pack, which is going to give us some extra powerful units. We don't know what we're going to get yet. We'll see. Oh, yeah, also... Let's see, your units are now strong enough to handle some missions without you. Sweet. So, we can go ahead and quick fight. This is another option. So, let's see what happened. Whew, quick fight. Three, two, one, go. Sick, sick, sick. <laughs> Boom. We just cruised through that. Mission complete. All right, so that's a quick fight. So, if you're just too lazy to attack, go for it. Roll with that. So, let's see what we get here. We got some... Ooh, 10 coins. I'll take that in any day. Mm-hmm. We got a handyman. Those are pretty sweet, too. That's another really cool unit. I never really got into it early in the beta, but um, <clears throat> now that we are globally launched almost, I've got to admit, handyman may become part of my arsenal because they actually have some really cool perks down the line. They pretty much just kind of knock out zombies. It works. So we got some cans and all that. Sweet. We'll look at the handyman later down the line. Quick fights will also use all of your team's stamina, but you get this one for free. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Did not want to risk losing all that. So we completed that just fine. So we're going to move on to this next level in just a moment. And we're going to get a rare pack if we win. I'm feeling pretty confident. But let's look at guilds really quick. So I'm going to go ahead. So you can join a guild and you get one borrowed unit from there. Now, for me personally, I'm going to join my guild that I created earlier on. That is called Zombination Nation. If you guys want to join, go ahead and join it. It is level 17. We're getting a pretty solid amount of perks. Let me let's go ahead and... Oh, hold up. Give me five seconds, guys. And I'm going to like go ahead and like allow myself in <laughs> oops okay but let's go ahead and get to vancouver here let's get this first attack going let's go ahead and fight we'll join a guild in a little bit my guild and we'll get that going so let's go ahead and fight here and i'm going to multitask while i'm doing this to go ahead and allow myself to join uh, settings application level one save actually hold up guys i'm sorry open saving <laughs> okay there we go minor detour here all right so let's check this out so we're gonna have some spitters drones and brutes this first way and infectors goodness gracious so we're gonna have a lot of stuff coming at us right here so right off the bat we have an outlaw we can use right these are pretty cool units they have pretty much like baby snipers as stated by the ceo of world domination um but yeah but they're pretty much many baby snipers so i'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and put my firefighter here with the paramedic and let's put a sniper hmm where do i want this sniper so my first sniper, I'm going to throw that right over here. So we're going to have a pretty much good view vantage point from each direction. I'm going to throw Captain Zeta, a lumberjack, and my gunfighter over there. Let's go ahead and put the Merc right over here. Put these guys right there and start these waves. Get them going. Let's go ahead and send it on its way. Let's go ahead and check these out really quick. So the lumberjack, pretty easy. Uh, lumberjack's full multiple zombies with their mighty chainsaws use them as the front lines against the horde you guys read the rest of that pretty sweet you guys check this out on your own but that's the lumberjack we got the merc my personal favorite the hired gun doesn't run mercenaries spray weak enemies without sawed off shotgun sadism uh yeah pretty sweet shoot multiple bullets in a wide arc great at thinning out the horde takes a while to reload but can be overwhelmed um yeah and then we have the Br Colossus. So this is pretty much an overpowered brute. Gets a whole lot of extra health. Very high health, but low damage. Protects the horde behind him. Low damage, but will take a while to kill. So there's that. 
quick, 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 quick stuff really quick. So we hope we can get that sniper involved for me. Working on taking out that brute really quick. And it looks like we're slowly taking him out. Let's go ahead and send this next area here. So did we lose anybody? I don't know if we did. I think we lost one maybe. I'm not even sure. All right, so we do have that firefighter up front, though. But he is a tank level four. He just, <laughs> he will not say no. He will just keep powering through there. So we took out both of those spitters there. Where are the rest of these areas? I don't know. No one's coming from anywhere. So I'm going to go ahead and throw down another lumberjack over there. And let's put another merc. So that, I'm feeling pretty confident about that. We're just going to look, be looking at some drones. Oh, goodness gracious. I just sent way too many. Oh, my gosh. Stim, stim, stim. All right, let's put another sniper down. A flare them here. There's the flare right in action right there. Perfect example. So let's go ahead and throw another firefighter down just for safekeeping. Goodness gracious, we're running into so much stuff. Goodness. Ah! Okay, looks like we're handling that area perfectly just like I anticipated. Now we just got to take out all of these guys. Oh my gosh, we are just getting hammered. Let me go ahead and throw down another gunfighter, another merc, and stem them up. Let's throw down a, let's throw down a lumberjack there to kind of distract everybody, take out, thin out those drones for me while we kind of finish off these last couple guys. Let's get them going. Let's got to take out two more spitters and we will be 100. That is 368 trophies in my hands, my pockets. I'll take it. Also, guys, my hat, if you're wondering, I'm a huge supporter of hats. I love hats. And you may see some random hats throughout my videos. Just doing me, guys. I love them. So, all right, continue on. Let's go and show the rewards. Ooh, looking good. Got a sniper. I'm happy with that good good stuff i'm a happy camper so we now have one pack we unlocked that let's see what we got hopefully we'll get some good i'm hoping for a scatter shot because that is my favorite what are we gonna get here what is it gonna be Ooh, here we go so we got paramedic mercenary firefighter mercenary here this is this is where it's gonna count guys what is it we got a fire chief, yes. Mm -hmm. These are pretty much higher buffed firefighters, as you can see. And they're one of my personal favorites, too. They're just super tanky. Once you get these guys leveled up, they're pretty much a brick wall. They will be able to take at whatever you throw at them, guys. They are super, super cool. So let's go ahead and join my guild now, now that we've gotten all that. Zom, Benation, Nation. So there's actually a lot of perks to actually join a guild because you get perks so as you can see i'm gonna go ahead and join it we are in so if we go to perks here we got all of these bonuses you can say for being in a guild mine's level 17 so we got a whole lot of perks already unlocked but if you are to start your own or if you want to join mine go for it but as you can see there's a whole lot of things you can get bonuses like discounts um bonuses bonus xp bonus food cans rations whatever you want to call them bonus trophies everything all sorts of things bonuses and as you level up further they just get better so that's pretty much a firm example of all of that i joined the guild as you can see let's go ahead and comment that's my other account joey right there what's up boys and that's that right there so let's go ahead and finish off vancouver here how long are we sitting in this video right now we are sitting at eight minutes and we got to power through these next two levels super fast so let's go ahead and fight we gotta we can borrow this guy let's go with the dead shot this is something you probably guys won't see too early you won't be able to play with unless you have a higher level guild but these guys are pretty much beefed up snipers that really only focus on mutated zombies and things like that which are similar to snipers now but they're just really nice to have so it looks like we're gonna be focusing on two areas coming around here so right here i'm gonna go ahead and move this guys right over here let's go ahead and throw down the paramedic my lumberjack and a gunfighter i'm gonna move these guys back just a little bit then we can get these out this outlaw involved and let's get a sniper let's use my dead shot let's put the dead shot right there uh oh didn't notice this okay time to adjust quickly we're gonna have all our snipers on this pad right here and let's start the waves i think we should handle that pretty well let's go ahead and send it out we're just gonna be facing some runners off the bat and we'll use this, hopefully those snipers can pick him off just before he reaches them. And just a couple drones and we are set. So next wave is coming over here. Looks like we're, he's got, so we got plenty of drones. They're going to run into this lumberjack here. These snipers are going to be picking off these guys. we got a Colossus though. It's all sorts of health right here. But those snipers are able, able to easily pick him off. Even without that dead shot, you guys should be perfectly fine with just one sniper, I think. Now over here, we're going to go ahead and send these groups of drones. I think I'm feeling very confident with all of them coming at me. Nothing coming over here yet, 
but I'm going to start kind of for I'm going to start to fortify this area just because we're going to get in some waves over there very soon. Same over here. We're starting to run in some rays, but we're waves, but we're doing just fine. I'm going to go ahead and throw down another lumberjack. I'm going to stim him up just because he's really in the He's in all sorts of problems here, but he's able to take out all those drones. That is his specialty. Take out drones, mow them down, get them out of the playing field. So it looks like we're doing very well here. Let's go ahead and send this wave over there. Send this wave. I'm feeling confident. I'm going to go ahead and flare my guys a little bit. Throw another sniper since we have one all set. Throw another fire chief, another little beefy guy up front. And how are we doing over here? Looks like we just got a Colossus to deal with. And I'm going to throw down my dead shot there since I have him all ready and to use. Just got to pick off that spitter over there and we are good to go there is the win i'm happy nothing more you can do there guys that's all you really need to do take out all those guys and you'll be set just got to fortify fortify and defend and think about where you're putting guys so you really want to have those meaty broody guys up front to where you guys can have that extra beef you know things like that because that's where you're going to get your most so we've got a gunfighter and some rations i love it got some cans but yeah it's really just thinking about where your beef is where your support is, things like that. So it looks like we got that cleared up. We're gonna have one more. This is pretty, it's gonna be a little bit longer. We're gonna be sitting at, oh, 13 minutes, I think. So we're gonna borrow that commando, another super powered unit. I'm gonna try not to use it just because, be similar to where you guys are just sitting in terms of difficulty and whatnot. So Outlaw, howdy, you got here just in Sam. So it looks like we're gonna be running to Dr. Zombowitz. We must defeat him. He is the hero unit for the infected side of the game. He's gonna be, he's gonna add a whole new dynamic of difficulty i believe to this next attack it's going to be difficult this is pretty much the final level here so i'm going to go ahead and throw down a lumberjack there since we're going to have a solid group of drones coming at us on that end let's use a merc because that's also really good for drones and just in case we do run into some interesting runners you know that should be fine just off the bat just because i'm gonna throw the paramedic over there so we've got the outlaw facing kind of set up over there let me go ahead and start these waves and we'll kind of see which wave comes next and we'll kind of go from there so right here i have my lumberjack my mercenary and my paramedic just to kind of help heal up the lumberjack once he gets kind of in the whole brute of things looks like we're gonna have another group set over there okay we're gonna have to do some rapid fire setting here i don't like doing that but that's what we're gonna have to do so let me go ahead and throw down these guys here support a gunfighter over there and captain zeta should be pretty well defended hopefully we'll be able to throw another firefighter over there with her in due time we got a sniper back there helping support and whatnot let's throw a merc over there too to help thin out the horde a little bit got captain zeta up front doing some good stuff and looks like we're running into some more drones over here so i'm gonna throw on a lumberjack just to help take out those drones a little bit quicker now it's time to get ready and prepare for dr zombwitz who's going to be coming in just a moment uh uh oh looks like these guys are really taking these guys are going like these guys are trying really hard to take down captain zeta and failing very hard so it looks like we're getting that first wave where doctors uh, shock doors on doctors on which is just gonna be coming down the lane these guys are just surrounding my friend captain zeta and they're just getting whooped okay so i'm gonna go ahead and start preparing this pad over here because i feel like they're gonna go down very soon just to be safe actually captain zeta is like not doing anything Come on, guys. Let's go ahead and take them out. So it looks like Dr. Zombowitz went down, and we're just going to have to take out a couple more drones here, and we'll be good to go. Just a couple more to drop, and I think we should be set. These guys are just really stubborn. Goodness gracious. So 368 trophies. That's going to get us the win, guys. And nothing more I can say there, guys. Looking good. Bang, bang. Looks like we're all tired out, but that's just in the nick of time once we finish Vancouver. Just going to continue that. So we got 11 cans, a mercenary, and a firefighter. I love it perfect vancouver and we also got the outlaw i love it guys so that's vancouver there hope you that will be helpful for you guys i hope you enjoyed watching that was the pretty tough <laughs> feedback again i still gotta do that all right so we did finish off vancouver and we're off to new orleans next but guys i really do hope you enjoyed this episode thank you so much for watching we'll be checking out new orleans and some new stuff in the next episode i really hope you guys did enjoy and i will see you guys in the next episode thanks for watching guys